Have you ever hated somebody? Yes. Yes, you can't stop. Is, did you just say you can't stop hating people? <laughs> um, well, I'm gonna be honest. In my opinion, I do not like the feeling of, of hating somebody. I don't like it. It just, it just kind of rubs me the wrong way. Same, same when people hate me. I just like don't like it. It's not a fun feeling. But, sometimes people do you wrong. They do you dirty. And you can't help it. It just happens. And it sucks. And I wrote a song about somebody that I do not like. That's okay. But happy now. It's called Junkie Mind. Past the boundary into water so deep and cold. How could I possibly know which way the river would flow?
Sometimes I think it's good to laugh. I do. I do love laughing. And sometimes I think it's good to scream a little bit. You know, let it out. Come on, miss. Is that for me? I can't see that light is. Thank you very much. Thank you. It's a little small, so I'm gonna put it in my pocket. Um, but like I was saying, you know, sometimes you really just gotta let it out. And there's a couple good ways to do that. Sometimes it's laughing, sometimes it's screaming, you know, sometimes, you know, some of you dudes for sure got a punching bag. I know it, I know you do. But sometimes, you just gotta cry a little. I tried to hide it through the silence while I played the girl. I'm laying up behind my eyelids while I'm holding on to the rage so badly I hate. I wish that all of this could be. Creating this album has been an honor, and I'm so glad it's finally out. I know a lot of you guys have been waiting for a long time for these songs. But um, when I was writing this this album, I did not know all these songs were going to be part of an album. I was kind of writing each one as its own thing, and I think that's why I love it so much. But there's one song specifically that kind of tied everything together with, uh, with the title and how I was feeling um, at the time. 
And I think generally I'm a pretty happy, excited, energetic dude. Um, but I, I also do think it is uh, unrealistic to expect that of myself 100% of the time. And um, I think when I was writing this album, I got, uh, I got pretty overwhelmed uh, with, uh, with people things. It, uh, it really, it was crazy. And, I see you, I see you. Well, that's for me. Uh, toss it over here. Is it, oh, is this, is this a crystal? Is this like, is this a crystal? Oh, or do you, are you, um, wait, this isn't offensive, I'm, ask, I'm asking a question. Are you like a, a, a like a, like a, hey, I'm an aquarium, I can't do that. Like, you not like that? Because I'm a cancer. What are you? Yes! Don't cancer! Uh, no, not that way, not that way. That's not what I meant. Don't take that the wrong way. Are you, uh, what are you, tortoise? What? Scorpion? I heart boobies. Yep, that's a scorpion. You yeah, are such a scorpion. Gosh, you scorpions. Anyway, back to what I was saying. Um, when I wrote this song, this song means a lot to me. This song is, uh, is very personal to me and what I was going through at the time. And I do love it. And, and live, I think this is a different experience. So if you have not heard this song before, it's called Hello Love. Take it but if you have, if you know the words, then sing them. And, and if you don't, please don't. Please don't. This is all I love. My favorite. Hello.
Okay. Yeah. Okay. Right, let's clear a path for security to get through. Everybody okay? Everybody's all good? for sure. Like we're friends, right? Like you wouldn't like, you know, but you would never even like kiss me, right? 
No, 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 I'm not like saying we should. Should we? No, 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 we shouldn't. <laughs> Stop. She's being great. No, like she's totally into me, but no, no, I'm serious. Like, I well, know well, uh, you're not into me, but like, like that. But like, you're kind of into me, like Loki. You're not? Oh. Yeah, we're friends. No, I, there's always one of those, you know? Kind of a situation shit. But, uh, but, that's you? That's you? Well, good luck, sir. <laughs> Wow, anyway, uh, well, moving on, uh, I wrote this song about my best friend, my best friend in the world, uh, his name's Eric, we love Eric, go Eric, uh, and I take my mother's word for this, but Eric and I technically met when I was six months old, so I've known him my whole life, and I've got four sisters, and Eric has five sisters, so, we don't got a lot of dudes in our life, so we needed each other, and that's important, I do think that's important, your family is Obviously very important, but if you don't have family, what do you have? No. Your friends. And I think wherever you go, okay, I'm, I'm gonna give you advice here. I'm 21 years old, you don't gotta take it, okay? But in life, wherever you go, I can promise you that your life will be more enjoyable, more sustainable, and more fun if you bring your friends with you. I do believe in that. So this one is for the people that brought their friends tonight. When I sing this song, you don't gotta think about Eric. Just think about who you're with. It's called Friend. I've been on my own Trying to carry this alone Only so much weight my back could take a sink in like a stone Then I see my face In a broken window pane I could use someone to help me pick up the pieces that remain When everything is blue Oh, 
for the lovely Mimi Webb. Yeah. 
You kill it every night. She just had a single to drop called Mistake. Everybody go listen to it after the show. She's incredible. Her voice is incredible. I hope you guys enjoyed her show because she's wonderful. Um, have you ever been scared of something? Yeah. I've been scared of a lot of things. Um, actually, there was one time when I was a kid. You guys ever had those little things, those little tubes? They're like PVC pipe, but it's not PVC pipe. And you put it together and you put marbles in it, and the marble goes. Pops out of the bottom and you can do it again. You know those things? Well, I used to play with those. And there was one time that, yeah, yeah, I did not talk to girls when I was a kid. Good gracious, no. Um, I played with marbles. Uh, but that, but there, there was one of them that was like, you know, the ones that are like kind of bent and it's for the corners. But then I put a straight one on the end of that so it kind of was like a little toy gun. And I was super into Star Wars and still am. And so I would, you know, I would like, like sit here. Don't play with guns, kids. Please don't. But, but I was, I had this thing that was like my favorite toy ever. It was like my super favorite toy. And my uncle had a boat and we went out on this boat with my family and we're riding on this boat. And I had this little gun in my hand that I never ever wanted to lose. And I thought it was just my favorite. And I had so much fun shooting it out at the little seagulls that were flying around. And then I thought, hmm, I bet this gun floats. Threw it in the water. Guess what? I did it. It did not float. That was the worst day of my life. That was the saddest moment of my childhood career. Um, and every day I would dream about that gun. That, sorry, I shouldn't even, I would dream about that little, that little, you know, that little, I, would, I would dream about it. And I was so terrified every day that I would lose it and then one day I just threw it away. And I still don't understand why I did that. I don't know, I'm kind of a do whatever on the fly kind of guy. So I just did it, but, Sometimes we have these things that we just throw away, even though we're so scared to lose them. And sometimes that can be a person. Sometimes we can do that to somebody, and that's even worse. That's way worse than that little guy. Um, and I wrote a song about, about it, and it is my favorite song on the whole album. It's called My Greatest Fear. And unfortunately, this is our, it's, it's about a person. It's not about that guy. What do you mean, friend? There it is. And I'm turning, thinking that my life's gone to waste Just fitting up in these things And if there's a God, I don't know where he's been We used to talk, but haven't spoken since so we met Yes, he ain't in LA, but you're here now That makes it better song.
if you thought I was only going to play songs that are released today, you don't know me at all. This song is probably my favorite song I've ever written. And it is not out. And again, if you know me, who knows when it will be out. But it will be out someday. It's called Pretty Slowly. And I know... Yes, we're very excited. We're so excited. What's your, what, what's your name? Kelsey? You're the one that, that, that hates everybody? You know what? I love that for you. Kelsey. Um, well, I know you guys are used to, you know, coming to concerts and you, you want to sing along to the songs because you know them, but let me do the work on this one. Hello, uh, uh, let's go. Pretty slow. him somewhere I no longer go. same four lines over and over and once you pick up on what I'm saying you sing it with me okay here we go same four lines when I look at you when you look at me oh there are still two lovers so who the hell are we when I look at you, when you look at me, oh, there are still two lovers, so who the hell are we? When I look at you, when you look at me, oh, there are still two lovers, 
years ago I lost somebody that was very close to me um, and losing somebody is never easy but I do think man again with the advice I, I really am 21 and what do I know but but I, there there is one thing that I'm very sure of um, no matter who you are no matter what you look like no matter where you're born how much money your family makes how much money you make what you look like, what continent you were born on, it does not matter. You will always, if you are a human being and you love people, you will lose somebody that you love. And it is so hard every time. Um, but I think something that we have that sometimes we take for granted are our memories. We have memories of those people that we lose. Um, and you can choose to remember the good things or the bad things or the awkward things or the funny things or whatever it is you want to remember. Um, but I did not, I mean, obviously, I wrote this song based on somebody in my life. Well, this song is not for me. This song is for you guys. And because of that, um, if I could ask you guys one favor tonight, if for the first two choruses of this song, if we could put our phones away, if you could have no phones. If, if you could be with me. And I know I see every night, I see I see a couple phones, but please, out of respect for me and the people that I have lost and the people that people in this room have lost, I will be right here during the third chorus, and it's gonna be fine. Nothing is gonna happen. Nobody's the world's not gonna end. Just put it down for two courses, that's it, okay? Can you promise me that? Woo! And if you see anybody take their phones out, just push them through. Just give them, don't actually do that, don't actually do that. Um, but no, you can just, you know, more. But, uh, please, if this is your first time hearing this song, welcome to the family, and if you know the song, sing it with me, this is in the stars. i 
You can do whatever you would like with that towel. Um, well, I'm just gonna play the intro to this song. I think you'll, I think you'll, I think you'll, I think you'll know it. It's been around for a while. Let me know. Yeah. 
is cold If my head is not the one you meant to hold
As the tour goes on, sing one last song. Can you do? And can you guess what you I've had a great time tonight. Thank you all for coming out. Honestly, it's a pleasure, it's an honor. It's an honor. Thank you. Thank you. But seriously, you guys have been a beautiful crowd. And I know out of any song that you do know, this is it. So I better hear everybody singing it, okay? It's beautiful things. Oh, Father is right, but lately I've been doing better. And the last four cold December, I recall. I see my friend every month. I found a girl my parents love. So come and stay tonight and I think I might have it all. And I thank God every day. There's no man as terrified as the man who stands to lose you. Oh, I hope I don't lose you. I need you, oh God.